Prime Minister Meles Zenawi's bold and historic address to the World Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO. May I be allowed to speak a matter which is the concern of the people of Ethiopia? I would be remiss in my duty if the Prime Minister of Ethiopia, if I were not to avail me of this occasion, Pew point out that in front of what used to be the Italian colonial office now, FAO's head office, stands the Axum Obelisk, which is registered as an object of world heritage by UNESCO. Though the Republic of Italy had signed an agreement with Ethiopia first in 1956, and thereafter two more similar agreements to return the obelisk to its rightful owner, nothing positive has thus far flowed from these ostensibly binding agreements. Italy had, instead been making convincing, unconvincing excuses for the prompt delivery of the obelisk. In the meantime, however, the obelisk continues to be the innocent victim of the fumes from Rome's heavy traffic pew environmental pollution. Therefore, we should not lose sight of the fact that this ancient piece of Ethiopian civilization is left to wreck Japun, the very nose of the staff of FAO, who see it on a daily basis by conference participants. Pew, by the world at large, I am pretty certain that you would agree that such a careless, insensitive act is tantamount to an immoral act that ignites the wrath of law-abiding nations and peoples. I would like to seize the occasion Pue call upon the government of the Republic of Italy to honor its word. I would also like to extend my call to the Italian people, Pue the Italian Parliament, to bring to a point the refugee status of the Oxum Obelisk. Last but not least, I call upon friends of Ethiopia and Italy to do their utmost in achieving success over this much-talked-about saga.